But this this was very sad. Simon, I don't know if you... You and I actually... Did a show with him. In the old building around mm -hmm. the corner from, from where we are now. Yeah. We we did a chat with uh, Glenn. He came in. We did, yeah. And... Uh, it doesn't seem that long ago. It was a couple of years back, and he was keen to get back in the game. I know. Time flies. Yeah. Time flies. You know, when you when you lose people like Ray Wilkins and Glenn Rhoda, it gives you pause for thought, doesn't it? Because he was a very nice man, a very unassuming man, very low-key. I met him uh, a couple of times during his time as a manager and also when we did some media together. And he was just very low-key, very calm. He was, Very, yeah. very sedate. You know, sometimes that, that, that my personality makes people sedate. But uh, <laughs> he was a very interesting man and very, you know, very keen to listen to other people and also very... Very, very methodical in his delivery and his analysis of things. Very much so. Very. You, you, you vaguely remember him as a player, Danny? Do you? I remember Glenn as a player. As I said, they're great left foot. Uh, yeah, vaguely. I mean, I, I met him more than once um, in in various places. Um, he came into Fulham a couple of times when I was there. Played against a couple of his teams um, and actually did some media with him. What a lovely guy. Thoroughly, you know polite, courteous, a, a, a gentleman and, and loved his football, just loved talking about football. It, it's it's always sad to hear the loss of somebody too early. I mean, I was with Alan Shearer yesterday when the news broke and he was obviously gutted, you know, really, really shocked um, because of course, he worked, yes. as, he worked yeah. as his assistant. He actually played under Glen Roder in his last ever Newcastle game, I think. Um, so he had a good re relationship with him. So... I felt the pain, you know, I felt I was with you guys when obviously the Julio news broke. So the empathy was, was there and, and losing anybody you care about and you spent time about is difficult, isn't it?